Today, this weekend. Yeah, today was a very warm day, but it is going to cool slightly as we head into the weekend. Still, though, plenty of sunshine in the forecast through the mornings this weekend, so sunblock is going to be a must. 77 degrees right now from Highway 24 and Peterson Road. We do have a few high clouds, though, streaming over the area. Those clouds, though, I don't expect them to produce any rain or snow for that matter. It is going to stay dry through tonight and into tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, a little cooler than it was out there today. Not cold by any means, just not quite as warm as it was today. And I do expect a better chance for a few storms, especially over and near the mountains this weekend. We'll talk more about that in just a second. I want to talk about your temperatures first. Tonight, we're dropping into the 50s, so a very mild night around southern Colorado. High temperatures tomorrow, again, they're not going to be cold by any means. They just won't be quite as warm as it was out there today. 75 degrees is what we'll end up with in Colorado Springs. Looking for a high temperature 81 in Pueblo with temperatures in the low 80s for the southeastern corner of the state. 60s and 70s more common west of I-25. Tomorrow morning, we'll start off with conditions that are very similar to what we have out there right now. We'll have high clouds, and Skycast is trying to suggest that we may see some areas of drizzle. I'm not buying that. I think we'll start off with dry conditions tomorrow morning. However, it may look a bit overcast. By the afternoon, around noon, we should start to see those clouds moving out. We'll get a few breaks of sunshine as we take you into the early afternoon to mid-afternoon. It's around 6 o'clock, though, or if you do have any camping plans, maybe you want to go for a hike tomorrow. During the afternoon in the high country, I do expect to see a few scattered showers popping up. They won't last long and they are not expected to be severe, but something that you want to watch out for if you are spending your Saturday afternoon in the mountains. Sunday morning, we are going to start off dry once again with plenty of sunshine through the first half of your Sunday. Notice, though, that by 3 o'clock, it's going to be a bit more active across the high country. It's very possible that a few of these showers could slide over the I-25 corridor through the late afternoon and into the evening. So Sunday bringing a slightly better chance for a few scattered showers. But again, I really don't expect anything to become strong to severe. So just your run-of-the-mill afternoon storms, very typical for this time of year. 75 degrees in Colorado Springs tomorrow, 78 on Sunday. We'll pop it into the 80s on Monday, then we'll be back in the 80s Wednesday through Friday. Notice, though, a daily chance for afternoon thunderstorms here as we head through the next seven days. Best chance, though, really looks to be Sunday through next Tuesday. In Pueblo tomorrow, your high temperature, 81 degrees. We'll hit 84 on Sunday with the chance for storms increasing as we head into Tuesday of next week. We drop it back to only a 10% Wednesday. We'll dry it out Thursday, Friday. 90s are back Wednesday. Thursday and Friday of next week. Canyon City, 80 degrees tomorrow. We'll hit 83 on Sunday. We'll keep the 80s in place all the way through early next week. We'll eventually make our way into the 90s, though, around Fremont County Thursday into Friday. And in Teller County tomorrow, your high temperature, 66. We'll hit 68 degrees on Sunday with a daily chance for storms around Teller County as well. We are going to kick the chance for storms up to 40% Sunday, Monday, again on Tuesday. We'll drop it back, though, to 10% Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. If you are doing anything outside this weekend, prepare yourself for storms that may move into your area with our Storm Tracker 13 weather app. It is free for your iPhone and your Android, and it's just one more way that we are keeping you ahead of the storms. Lots of sun today, so. Yeah, yes. it was very nice out there today. We'll have sunshine at least for the first half of the day, Saturday, and again on Sunday. But just be aware if you do have any outdoor plans, maybe barbecues or picnics.